this time of artificial intelligence, making a 3D animated movie is not just for the people that know animation and know 3D. With AI tools, anyone can turn a regular video into 3D animation. This video gives you a step-by-step -step guide on how to do it, so by the end of this video, you can create your own 3D animated movie. It's only gonna take a couple of clicks, so let's begin with step number one. Take a look at this. So these are some examples that are just incredible that I wanna show you. My first love is animation. I've started playing with some software that makes it easy for me to create something like this. I just ask you, do we got any people here from out of town? Well, stay out of town, okay? Because we don't need you. LA's crowded enough. And also, just take a look at this. So this is from Deep Motion. As you can see, there's a video in the background, and you can basically put that on top of a 3D animated character that makes the creation so much easier than before. As you see, cartwheels. So this will get included in most of the future of AI animation. All you need to do is go to Deep Motion. This is the software that we'll be using that is easy for anybody to use. So just click free to use, sign up now. Now that you're on the inside, all you need to do is click on animate 3D. And we're not gonna create right away, we're just gonna go to 3D models. As you can see, you can use the stylized avatars or the realistic avatars. You can also upload your own 3D model, which is very useful for game developers or visual effects. But we're gonna create a new one from the Ready Player Me. So let's begin by clicking feminine. As you can see, you can take a photo of yourself and turn it into an avatar or just continue without a photo. Here they have some pre-made templates that we can use. So we're gonna select this one, click on next. And here you can customize the entire avatar. I'm just gonna do that real quick. All right, I think that this character is pretty cool. Just click on next and continue without sign up. Name your new character and click on save. And now a word from our sponsors. Stop using complex AI tools. This allows you to work faster, easier, and better. Usually I spotlight new flashy AI tools, but today, I'll show you a reliable tool that has been refining content writing since 2018. This AI tool is called WordTune. It's been around before ChatGPT and is trusted by millions of users. It may not build a business in one click, but it will transform your writing. Step number one, just go to the WordTune Chrome extension and click on Add to Chrome. Step number two, open the app that you write the most in, I use Gmail, but it also works on LinkedIn, Slack, Google Docs, and everywhere on Chrome. Now let's say I wanna say, hey Paul, send me the project. I just highlight, click on rewrite, and it gives you examples of how to use better communication. Step number three, you can also click on the WordTune Chrome extension and open WordTune Editor. Now you can click generate with AI and write a blog post, meeting agenda, Twitter thread, or anything you'd like. We're gonna start with a Twitter thread about how to lose a kilo a week. Post, WordTune is a reliable AI, it's trusted and has credibility. And if you feel like one of them need a little bit more spice, just click on the spices button and it allows allows you to recreate that sentence in a better way. Let's add some comic relief and it just tags the joke at the end there. Just go to wordtune.com to get started today and use the coupon code AIND10 to get 10% off your annual subscription. Thanks to Wordtune for sponsoring this part of the video. Now, the next step is just to click on create animation. Here you want to toggle on 3D animation and here you can drag and drop a video. This can be either of yourself or if you don't have files, all you need to do is go to pexels.com, select videos, and then we're gonna search for dance. This platform gives you 8,700 free videos that you can download and use for yourself. Deep Motion does not want you to do two people in the frame and they don't want you to cut off, for example, the legs. So this one wouldn't work. This video here wouldn't work because you can't really see the entire character, but this video would work perfectly. They have a maximum of 20 seconds that you can upload. As you can see, you can see her entire character bright and easily. So this one will definitely work for us. 
all you have to do is go to the top, click on the drop down menu and select maximum the full HD. If you do 4K, it doesn't work and just click on download selected size. Now just drag the video onto here, rename it Dancing Girl and now it would just analyze. We're going to trim and crop it because we don't need 19 seconds. So we're just going to click on the arrow down here. 15 seconds should be okay. Click on save. And here is an important part. When you click on animation output, it's important that you include the physics filter. This is because it reinforces stronger joints and removes the self collisions and clipping. So for example, the hand going through the leg and stuff like that, click that on, click on the face tracking and the hand tracking, then go to video output. Just click on enable MP4 output because we love MP4. And I recommend going to the cinematic camera mode instead of fixed or face. Also to continue with this tutorial, we need to go from default to solid color and we're gonna choose the background color of green. Then just click on create. Here you can see all these settings. And the great part is that you'll be able to export all of these formats. But for now, just click on start job. If you like this video so far, drop a like. Also comment down below AI animation and I will dive deeper and create more videos about this. Now that it's done, just click on okay. And here you can see our character. <laughs> It looks so sick. As you can see, it's taken all the movement from the character in the back and animated onto our character that we created, which is just so much better than the old way of animating. And this is gonna be the future. Now, all you have to do is click on download. You can select FBX if you're using softwares like Blender. We are gonna, for the purpose of this video, do MP4 and click on download. The next step is go to DaVinci Resolve 18. This is the best free editor that I know of. You can use any other video editor that you like, but we're gonna continue with this. So just click on free download now. Then head over to Google and search for 3D set image. And we're gonna download one that looks like this. So just save image as. Now just drag the set into DaVinci Resolve and drag the animation we just downloaded. To do it as easy as possible, just drag the set down on the first layer and drag the dancing girl on the second layer. Now just make sure you have the dancing girl selected. Go up to the effects tab, go down here and click on open effects. Then just search for key. Then we're gonna drag the 3D keyer over to our dancing girl clip. Then it's important you select from the drop down menu the open effects overlay. Now go to the right and just click on this button here and just drag around the image. As you can see, it's almost perfect. It just has a little bit of a stroke around it. So all we need to do is drag the D spill a little bit to the right or maybe maximum and you got no green in the edges. If you want to crop away the watermark in the bottom right, just select crop and remove it on the right. And now all we have to do is click on play and you got this beautiful 3D animated character in your scene. Do you feel more confident now being able to do this? Well, drop a like on the video. Also, don't forget to check out our Patreon down below for more exclusive content. And if you wanna watch more of my videos, click on the video on the screen right now. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.